So ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, the iOS 12 jailbreak has finally released to the public. Um, this is for iOS 12 through iOS 12.1.2. And before I even get started with the video, just make sure, um, just to verify, go into your settings, and then go into your general, and then go into your about, just to confirm that you are on iOS 12.1.2 or lower. If you're on the appropriate iOS 12 firmware, congratulations, you are able to jailbreak today. Now, fortunately, the time of this recording, iPhone XS, XS Max, XR, or even the iPad, the iPad uh, third generation, you cannot jailbreak today or the time of this recording, obviously, because the jailbreak is not yet available for A12 devices. I'm going to be showing you guys two methods, one with the computer and one without a computer, just to show you guys best of both worlds, why not since we're here. I'm going to launch my settings application and I'm going to make sure I delete any kind of updates. This will jack up the process. So make sure you delete any downloaded iOS firmware. So which is going to be the, the latest version of um, iOS 12.1.4, I believe. This is the latest version of iOS 12. You do not want to update to this because it will patch the exploits of the jailbreak. So do not download it and it definitely do not install it. But if it is downloaded, just make sure you go into your iPhone storage and just delete it. Um, you'll, you'll see something iOS 12.1.4. Now I'm going to throw this link in the description. This is to install Tweakbox. It's an application. It's a web application where it's going to allow you to download the uncovered jailbreak. So um, I'm going to accept this and we're going to go into apps and we're going to go into tweaks or tweak box apps. And then we're going to go into, we're going to look for uncover and there we go. Uncover jailbreak. You just look for that. And the time this recording, obviously, this is version 3.0. This is the support of the iOS 12.1.2 jailbreak. And throughout time, they will support, um, you know, other devices too as well. And Substrate Insidia is working. It's still in beta stages. And we're going to talk about that too in a little bit. But once you tap on install, you tap on install again. And then once, um, once you do that, you look for an application. And as you guys can see, it's right down there. I got a bunch of apps that <laughs> I never launched up. And you're going to see it there. But before you do that, you got to make sure you go all the way into your settings application. And you got to make sure you go into general. And you got to go into uh, profiles and device management. And you got to just make sure you verify the application, trust it, trust again. And then you will have the uncover jailbreak, which we're going to go back. And it is right there. And then all you got to do is just tap on that beautiful blue jailbreak button. Now it is going to take you, it will take you three tries. And I like the computer method because it shows exactly everything. Like you're going directly to the uncover website, you're downloading the IPA. But without talking about it, let's just actually do it. I'm going to throw this link in the description. Just download the latest version, basically. This is the beta 30. Yeah, so we're going to download that one. And also, you will need to download Cydia Impactor. Now, I'm going to also throw this down below. And you just download whatever version you have. So, Mac OS, Windows, you click whatever which one you have. Once you have those two things installed, make sure you connect your iDevice to your computer. Launch up Cydia Impactor. Click and drag the IPA file. I'm going to actually zoom it in a little bit so you guys can see. And you just click and drag, enter in your Apple ID. This is completely safe. Now, if you have two step authentication, make sure you log into your Apple ID. So, I'm gonna throw this link in the description. Over here is a lot of sensitive information, but you want to look at the app specific password. You want to click generate password, and you can just enter in the password label, it doesn't really matter. And then they will generate your app specific password. Just copy and paste this into Cydia Impactor. And once you do that, the IPA will be automatically installed to your device. Make sure you have your device in hand and you just want to go into settings and there it is right there. Now I actually deleted the application for the no computer one just to show you guys the PC version or the computer version. You want to go into settings general and you will want to go to um, where is it? Okay device and profile you tap on your Apple ID that you enter in in the impactor and you want to tap on trust and then you should be able to open up the application. And then finally, you can disconnect your device. You can close your laptop because you're done with it. And then now we could just focus on the device itself. Now turning off Siri may improve the jailbreak process. So we're gonna turn off Siri and we're gonna actually enable airplane mode and we're gonna enable the jailbreak process. So we're gonna launch the uncover jailbreak and we're gonna tap on jailbreak. 
yeah so there so screenshot so it says the system snap shot has been successfully renamed so the device will restart you tap on ok it's going to reboot your device ok tap on jailbreak again all right and it's going to reboot again but that's ok I would say this is more reliable than the um, electric jailbreak just a little bit so now okay so now this is the bootstrap has been extracted and it's going to restart your device yet again at least now it's telling you what's going on is my device jailbroken you guys want to place a bet yes it is yes it is you guys see that beautiful city icon man oh it's crashing though what should i do you're gonna jailbreak again <laughs> It's okay. Now, if the uncover utility crashes, you will have to do the entire process again. Um, you know, extracting the app either using Tweetbox or using your computer. Okay, let's see. After this, I gotta leave. I'm gonna be right back, and I'm gonna, you know, show you guys some tweaks and whatnot. But I gotta get out of here. Friends want to go out. Eight hours later. All right, guys. So the next morning later. If you having problems opening up your city, just launch the uncover tool and just go into settings and you're going to have to look down until you see, um, where, you, where is it? Reinstall Cydia. So if that's if Cydia is crashing for you, just make sure you tick that box on. Um, but thankfully Cydia is working for me. I did that and Cydia is booting back up. So that's pretty much how you jailbreak. Now the first tweak I installed was Eclipse. I'm just going through the tweaks that I normally install first. It, you know, Eclipse is going to basically enable dark mode, or basically it's a dark mode for your iOS device. Um, the next tweak I download was ultrasound, so it's a volume HUD. So you guys can see my device is completely sleeping, and you can still see the volume HUD, or even you can see it right there on the side. You know, very very nice, very very minimalistic tweak. Another thing to install is called Tweak Compatible. So if um, you know if anything, you can see if the tweak is really compatible. It'll appear on the bottom here is letting you know if it's compatible or not. And this is judged by the community. So if the tweak works for you, just tap on work. If it's broken, you tap on broken. So you can see on the bottom it says it's working, and this is um, Bazi. And the last tweak I'm going to show you with you guys today is called Short Look. Short Look is going to basically you know completely change the way you, how you get notifications on your lock screen so let me do a test notification so this is how your notifications will come up and I gotta say it looks neat and it'll say battery life too as well because you know the whole entire background is black so as you know turn off the pixels especially on the iPhone 10 um, or taking advantage of that OLED display you can see you know it, it could be very very handy and it looks neat I hope you guys enjoyed this video I'm sorry if it was unprofessional quote unquote but I had to share with you guys this jailbreak because you guys love my jailbreak videos and I gotta say thank you guys so much for all your support I just hit 10 million views on the channel you know if it wasn't for you guys I wouldn't be making this video right now um, so I hope you guys have a simple day if you have any questions let me know down in the comments down below and other than that your boy pops and I catch you guys on my next video big things is happening just stay tuned and also, if I haven't said already on the video, thank you so much for 25,000 subscribers.